In this video, we're going to make a jetpack with fuel that runs out, and we're going to do that using the sprint button from another video I made. So they have a little energy bar at the bottom left that goes down. So I'm just going to copy that and, and have a look at that other video if you haven't seen it yet. So in assets, scripts, and somewhere in here, uh, if you've done the last video, you may have made a jetpack file already. Um, that's simple, so I, I'm actually just going to get it out of the way and name it simple jetpack. Don't worry about that if you haven't. Uh, right click, create, C sharp script. So this one is going to be jetpack, the good jetpack. And open that up. And because jetpack is going to be so close to sprinter, another video I just made, um, we're going to copy paste all of this. And it's usually a really bad idea to copy code, um, but it's so similar that we're going to do that. And I expect sprinting and jetpack to become very different later, but right now at the start, they're just so close. So we're going to paste that into jetpack and rename the class name to jetpack. And to rename a lot of these variables, I'm going to press F2. Um, it might be different on your program, but it's refactoring or renaming because stamina here shows up all over the place. And I want to just rename stuff once. So stamina, I'm going to do F2, call it fuel. Max stamina is max fuel. I press F2 again. Or here, we don't need these. We do need character motor. We also need a character controller. Instead of is running, we're going to do is flying. We need this, but I'm going to call it fuel rectangle and fuel texture. Again, these are by pressing F2, renaming everything. So when we start, we also need to find the character controller. Just like in the first jetpack video I made, CC will be used to get our velocity right now. Uh, we don't need that. And this is pretty much the same, but the fuel rectangle is Y. So the distance from the top of the screen is going to be just a little less. So that we can have sprinting and jetpack if we want. And the color is red this time. Set running, we don't need that. Right here, is flying is true. We don't need a function anymore. Okay, is flying, that's good. Fuel, that's good. Is flying is false. That's good, and that draws it. And now we need to apply our flying. This is just like the jetpack video, the first one. So if we're flying, then our CM velo set velocity is going to be a new vector. Just like that first video, we're going to keep our x velocity. Our up velocity, our y, is going to be 10, and we're going to keep our z velocity. So that's going to be our flying, and actually the, here, the, the key code, we don't want left shift, we want left uh, control, I guess. And now we can save that. And so the player here, uh, you may have sprinter, that's, you can keep that, and add a jetpack. You can have both of these now. So we've got two bars now. When we hold control, we can fly around like a jetpack, and it recharges when we let go. And we also have the sprint. We can hold sprint. So we've got both of them.